What is going on guys? Greg Ellis TV. I'm going to show you some tricks for the lock screen and some information you can put with face widgets. So face widgets basically, just to show you, is uh, it's not this lock screen. This is the always on display. It's when you go here and you have the clock up here. You can swipe left and right. I have the weather. I have some calendar information and then that's basically it. So if I go out of here and I'm going to go into settings. And then what we're going to do next is we're going to go into lock screen and then go into face widgets and face widgets, like I showed you, is just where it is. And you can display some information that could possibly be very really relevant to you. So you don't have to always open up your phone or go fully into the phone without doing that. So I have weather turned on. So that's going to use the weather information that's on your home screen as well. If you have that widget there. It's going to pull the weather wherever you're located. And then it's also, if you want today's schedule, it's going to pull information from your calendar if you want it on. Music, I keep off. And the reason I keep it off is because um, I use Spotify. And Spotify mixed with this music control on the lock screen doesn't always work really well. So I turn that off and it just uses the default uh, Spotify music control so it works perfectly. So I keep music off. Next alarm, you can keep that on if you have an alarm going off. I don't work uh, a nine to five anymore, so I don't have an alarm showing up, so I don't need it. And then Bixby routines is things like, you know, you can set up with uh, Bixby routines in terms of like, maybe when you get into your car, your Bluetooth turns on and uh, Wi-Fi turns off and blah, 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 blah. You can have that show up there as well. So I have, like I said, you can have that. And then also you can reorder these. And if the way you're gonna reorder them, so I have, if you wanna reorder them, just you know, go like this, drag them around whatever. And then when you're done, hit the back button. But basically it's going to be in the order that you see first on the lock screen. So first I'll see my weather. And then when I swipe uh, left to right, it's going to show my schedule and so on and so forth. So that's how you would control that and get some more information on there. And I'll show you again. So there you go. And so I'm going to show these two things is my clock. It's going to show the weather wherever I am. And then it's also going to show uh, my schedule and then the other thing like I was saying the music I'll play some Spotify real quick here just to show you So we'll play a song here So I have that song playing when I lock it even though I have music turned off on that face widget It'll still show right here and again, it works perfectly fine. I was having trouble where I couldn't um, you know, change the track or pause and play. Now that I've undone music from here, I can do that because it uses the default Spotify settings. So if you use Spotify, you definitely want to do what I just showed you right there. But anyways, guys, that is how you do face widgets and just some interesting things on there that you can do. And again, it's going to save you a little bit of time from going directly into your phone. You can do that all from your lock screen. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. Let me know what you uh, have on your lock screen in terms of me, mine. You saw I have my calendar, the clock, and uh, music. Well, my Spotify shows up and the weather. So let me know what you guys do uh, show on yours, and I'll see you guys down the road. Peace.